twins! <laughs> so friends, Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator, has made it back to Lavender Town. Dude, oh my god, can you believe that shit? We almost lost two Pokemon to a Wobbuffet in the last episode. I was so freaked out, but uh, we managed to skirt our way through. It's amazing! I have no idea how that happened. We're on a new route now, so I can catch a new Pokemon. I could have caught one back there too, but I'm not in need of Pokemon like I was. I'm just kind of trying to keep the team that I have together. Lest it uh, fall apart at the seams. Oh god, a fucking Chansey! Oh! You may remember that we saw one of these in my rival's team, and I hated it! <laughs> There's the fake out. Hopefully it's gonna do a shit ton of damage. Just fucking destroy this thing. Actually, that is pretty good. If we could Mega Kick, it'll be over. Yeah, of course not. Of course not! Why would it? <clears throat> so, Chansey soft boiled. Fucking balls. Probably gonna minimize on the next turn because just, just an asshole. I'll keep trying to Mega Kick. It should KO it, I think. Probably. Yeah, it's a really good fucking attack. Quite a haymaker, indeed. And Acorn's actually almost level 30. Uh, this guy's gonna send in an Ekans, which, you know, uh, is pretty scary to a grass type. However, I do have Elvis waiting in the wings. So, I'll send him out. Fuck, I'm so glad I didn't lose this thing to a Wobbuffet. Ugh! I was so scared. <laughs> I'm so glad we made it back. All right, the glare's not too bad, uh, especially on Elvis because he's already slow as piss. And did, is he the one I gave? No, he's the one I gave an amulet coin. I don't think I have a quick claw because this is not uh, soul silver. <laughs> and there's the dig. Here's the coffee. Mmm. Mmm. That is a large bucket of coffee. <laughs> it's kept me going through all these episodes. Thank you, coffee. Buck 79 at 7-Eleven. Fucking can't lose. Acorn's level 30 now. He's a big boy. All by himself. Big boy. Big boy. Missed the big chance. Big boy. That's right, you did. You got punk. You got punk, you fucking punk. Uh, let's switch. No, we can't dig. <laughs> uh, and then we'll put Clam Slam a little more near the front in case we get in a double battle, because I forgot that was a thing uh, in this version. Should we catch something? Let's catch something! Acorn, use cat. Good boy. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Oh my god. Oh my god. We can also catch something in Rock Tunnel. Ooh, a spinner rack. Ariados is not a particularly uh, amazing Pokemon, but I'd like to catch the Spinarak just just for the uh, the Pokedex entry. I like it as like a uh, a Pokemans. Oh my God, we need something that will hit it softer, or we just need to throw a Pokeball. Why not? See if it works. Come with us, little Spinarak. You'll be so happy. Does. He wants to come. How cute. I love him. Um. Yep. It spins a web using fine but durable thread. It then waits patiently for prey to be trapped. And I know just what nickname to give him. And our spinner act is named Webster. Wonderful. Webster was transferred to Bill's PC. It was placed in box one. As it should be. All is well. See if we can fight something else on this route. Looks like another scientist. You should be informed. You need strategy to win at this. Well, my strategy is collecting random Pokemon and then throwing them against your random Pokemon and hoping that my random Pokemon are better. <laughs> it sounds like a lot of luck, but it's not. Ooh, a Scyther. And that's actually a really good switch for my, uh, my Elvis. I am not going to switch. Don't need to worry about pursuit. Except I'm paralyzed. God damn it. All right, I'll use a Paralyze Heal. Elvis is a good boy. He a good boy. Do I have Paralyze Heals? You better. Nope, nope, didn't even buy him. Balls, fucking balls. That's fine, just keep doing it. <clears throat> False Swipe, pretty cool. 
I would like a Pokemon with False Swipe, just for uh, catching other wild Pokemon. And Spore. Super Smeargle action! Teach it all the best catching Pokemon moves. Web, False Swipe, Spore. Maybe Mean Look instead of Web. I don't know if Web is an actual fucking Pokemon move. <laughs> All right, he's sending out Kadabra. I'm gonna keep fucking Elvis in here. No problem. No problem. I'll just bite it in the face and you'll see what happens. He tried to disable my rock throw. It really wouldn't have mattered, because here's the bite. Wow. Wow. You see that, everybody? Gather around. Look at this Kadabra corpse. That's amazing. Elvis made that all by himself. Rhydon. Hmm. He's got pretty good defense, but uh, I'll keep Elvis in here. Oh, he's level 32 now. Well, level 30 as well now. <laughs> Not 32. <laughs> That's, uh, misinformative, or I don't know what I'm trying to say. I had too much coffee, my brain's moving faster than my mouth. Uh, let's get the water pulse. Water pulse, boy! Can't resist. Four times super effective. Slam that shit. The ride on turned into a giant pile of mud. We just fucking walked through it, and then I was like, pay me. Fuck you! Pay me! It's not logical! It's really not. <gasps> what? Elvis is evolving! Ah! <laughs> Congratulations! Your Elvis evolved into Pubita! Fuck yeah, man. So, uh, we're well on our way to a, a gigantic Tyranitar. It evolves to level 30, which is actually a little earlier than it normally evolves uh, in the game. I think it normally evolves at 36 or 38 or some shit. But I have the uh, caps lowered, so I can... So I can, uh... Keep it interesting, you know? Make sure that uh, everybody evolves by the time we get to the Elite Four without too much grinding. There's twins over here. And twins! Twin power is fantastic, did you know? I had no idea. I've never been a twin. I was best friends with twins. And they weren't really twins because one was a boy and one was a girl. But, you know. Oh, he's got a shelter and a Dunsparce. Well, I've got a shelter and a... Ambipom. And we'll see how this matchup goes. I will tickle. <laughs> tickle. Tickle Dunsparce. And, uh. Bleh. Also, Water Pulse it as well. Gang up on that thing! We like Shelter. That's why we're not gonna fucking beat him up yet. Save you for last, punk. Clam Slam use Water Pulse. It's gonna be super. Hand Slob and Clam Jam. <laughs> this is my doubles battle team. They're the shit! Aurora Beam is not very effective. Oh, there's the rollout. We are gonna need to finish that thing fast. Um, so go ahead and scratch the Dunsparce, and we'll Water Pulse the Dunsparce, and hopefully it'll die this turn before the rollout gets to be too much, because every turn it doubles in power. So that little wedge that uh, Hand Drop was missing would then be double that, and then Double that, and then double that, and then basically he's KO KOing your whole fucking team with one shot. It can only hit like five times in a row, but it's definitely uh, after the third time it's enough to, to KO basically anyone. <laughs> um, so yeah, all we got now is a shelter. I'm going to go ahead and tickle him. We'll sl switch our little uh, clam slam out for a bit. Send a Mr. Freeze who has the headbutt, which is better than tackle. And I don't want to whittle that thing down with attacks that are not super effective. Because why? There's no point. What the fuck? <laughs> Shelter is going to, uh... Aurora Beam. My hand job. Cold. I hate a cold hand job, dude. It's fucking awful. Like, blow on it first or something. Jesus! There's the headbutt. And then the scratch. Wow! The thing just got wrecked. Supersonic, no problem. One of them's gonna hit you next turn. Even if it's a little hand job, it doesn't matter. Mm-mm. And Mr. Freeze with the KO. Even through the confusion. Through 
ice or sleet or snow or hail or mist or rain or other types of inclement weather. Mr. Freeze is here. But we used our twin power. Yeah. I guess it sucks after all, huh? <laughs> uh, yeah, team looks okay. We'll keep it going. Ooh, shit. Hi, buddy. <laughs> I didn't even see him. School is fun, but so are Pokemon. You think? Yeah, me too. I agree with both. I must admit. Got an RK9. It's alright. Get out there, hand job. We're gonna do a thing. Oh, fuck. The goddamn Intimidate every time. Well, um, um, Clam Slam. Clam Slam! You gonna do the thing. You gonna do it real good. Here's the Ember. And actually, I'm feeling less and less confident as I'm watching Clam Slam's HP get taken away in giant chunks by that fucking resisted Ember. But it seems fire moves are all he has, so we'll stay in here. Hope I can KO. Nope. Maybe we can take one more. Ugh. Ah! Fuck me! I'm an idiot, dude. God damn it. So who's the veteran of the team now? Acorn? I guess so. God damn, I'm a shithead. What a mistake, dude. What a mistake. I cannot believe it. <laughs> it's so hard to like think of anything to say. Like, uh, what am I saying now? I miss Clam Slam. What the fuck? Never have a gigantic, massive, awesome shelter. Nothing. I, I can't even words. You made it clear to me that I should stick with school. <sighs> me too, I guess. Fuck. I never thought he would be KO'd. And because I never thought he would be KO'd, uh, that's why he got KO'd. Makes sense to me. I like Nidoran, so I collect them. <sighs> I like awesome Pokemon, so I collect them. And then they die shortly thereafter. God damn it. So shitty, man. Oh well. What can we do about it? Pick up, move on. Now there's room for uh, use Acid or Webster on the team, I guess. Man, that dead box is gonna be fucking full. He's got the Absorb. Doesn't matter, we lost our water type Pokemon. I'm such a shithead, dude. If he had used Ember again, if RK9 had used Ember again, I would've fucking lived, but I was just like, yeah. He's definitely gonna use it again. We'll gamble a fucking Pokemon's life on it. And, uh, it was wrong. It was really wrong, because I got bit, and it was not nice. And... And... And what? And what?! I'm fucking... God. The veterans. They're, they're dying from, like, the oldest to the newest. That's fucked up, man. That doesn't seem right to me at all. That's like a child bearing her, her young or something. Her parent bearing her child. <laughs> a child bearing her young. <laughs> that's, that's also creepy, but in a really different way. Alright, so he's got a Fero. God damn. I'm such a shithead. Yeah, we still got Elvis. We'll see. We'll see how, how, how much longer people last. I guess I can't say shit anymore that anybody's gonna live because... I just relentlessly seem to, uh, make mistakes. Horrible, horrible mistakes that I can never take back. God damn. Oh, I shed skin the paralysis. <gasps> That's a cool ability. I forget what Elvis had, but, uh, I think I like shed skin a little better. Save me a paralyze heal, thank you so much. And kill the Fero. Kill it, Dad! Kill it, Dad! Alright. No problem. Why? Why? That's... I fucking ask myself every day, bro. Uh, what do you have to say down here? We must look silly standing like this. I... I wasn't gonna say anything. <laughs> you can do what you want. It's your Poke Life. Oh my god, that's... She got five Pokemons. Let's see what they be. Level 19. 
shouldn't be too much of a problem. Except he gets the Intimidate on Ambipom immediately. So I'm going to go into... Elvis. Elvis. Fucking... Basically can't go wrong. There he is. He's so cute. He's got little spikes on his tail. He used to have only one spike on his head. And it multiplied. Let's fucking rock slide. Rock slide. Fuck, man. I can't believe Clam Slip's dead! Ugh. How did Clam Slam get crit? No, he didn't get crit. I was just pushing it to the end. I'm such an idiot. I, I can't, can I say that again? How the fuck? How the fucking shit? Ah. Alright, he's got a layer on. No problem. I'm pretty sure Elvis can fucking just destroy this entire team. Here comes some dig. That's super four times effective shit. And he's gonna try and like use some kind of steel move and break down the rock side of my, my little Elvis, but ain't gonna happen. Ain't gonna happen. Too big, too strong, too fast, too dig. <laughs> there he is. Lots of XP for my little boy. And Tauros is coming back in. I don't know why she switched it out. I guess she thought Laron would like surely be able to wall my fucking <laughs> my ground type attacks. Um let's bite it, I suppose. It might not KO because I did get the intimidate just now. Oh, but I critted. No problem. I don't think it would have KO'd if I didn't crit. But uh I can't substantiate that claim. Alright, you got a bowl picks? You got a bowl picks? I'm gonna get Tranny. Tranny deserves some XP. Because even though Elvis has like super effective moves, he's now 31, and I've got like this OCD thing which usually ends up killing Pokemon. <laughs> ah! Can't switch it out yet. Can't we have to stop using that Pokemon that would clearly be the better choice because it's slightly over leveled compared to the rest of the team. It's such a stupid like thing, but I just can't stop myself from doing it. And he's got a Metang. God damn. I hate these things. I can't remember if it levitates or not. I don't think so. I think it's got like metal body and shit like that. So Dig should be able to fuck it up relatively well. Hopefully it won't hit me with a steel type move. Because that's uh, a worry for rock type Pokemans. There it is. Badoosh! Fucking sacked. Body bag! Body bag! <laughs> Alright, we did good. We did a good thing. Don't you worry about it. A C dot. Yes, I do kind of worry about that. So we'll go into Mr. Freeze. We've got that ice type move. Actually, the only ice type move now because. If you didn't know, uh, Clam Slam's dead. Fuck! I hate it. I hate it so much. Whatever happened to... Hand Slob and Clam Jam? Hand Slob and Clam Jam is over! It's fucking done! Can't stand it. Can't even stand it. Alright, whatever. We ground out this route pretty good. There's uh, one person left over here, but she's facing the wrong way. She don't give a fuck, I don't give a fuck, all right? <laughs> so friends, this has been our Pokemon Fire Red Nose Lock. I do hope that you've enjoyed. And if you did, I hope you will leave that like, that comment, that subscription. And uh, we shall lay Clam Slam to rest. I shall heal up and see you guys in the next one, friends. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I hope you will join us for the next one, friends. <sighs> Until then. Bye-bye! One, two, three.